For today's video blog, I want to give you an update what's going on with the TV show. It's end of August now, coming up toward the end. Been a lot of activity all year. Been traveling a lot, been going to the Middle East for this new TV show I'm working on. And I can't give you all the details yet, but next month I can. It's going to be really exciting news. You guys are going to like hearing about this one. But with my TV show here in the United States on sport fishing, we've been traveling locally, you know, going fishing different places. We went up to Alaska last month. We're in Mexico this past couple weeks ago, fishing East Cape. We did really good there. Caught some marlin, caught some dorado. And this coming Sunday, we're aboard the sheep, the chief, fishing with Chris Randall again, the old skipper of the Indian, which you've seen me on for many, many years. And Chris is doing a great job on the chief. We've already had a couple trips with him this year. And we'll be back with him this coming Sunday, going on a day and a half trip, meaning we depart at 9 p.m. on Sunday, fish all day Monday, and return 6 a.m. Tuesday morning. And on that Monday, we fish from sunrise to sunset. It's a great deal, 295, great fishing, great crew on the boat, uh, Ian in the galley, everything's just really nice on that boat. We have a great time. It's just like being on the Indian, but on a bigger vessel, a little bit more comfortable. It's just a lot of fun. Also coming up soon as we have a trip uh, tomorrow, we're gonna be on the Gale Force. I'm pretty sure that ship's sold out. Not 100% sure, you can look online, but I'm pretty sure it's sold out. We'll be up in Emeryville come September. Those, both of those trips are sold out. I think the only other trip you can really get on for the summer uh, where we have some spaces in September, and I guess that's even kind of early fall, would be a, a, chief, a trip back on the Chief. We're gonna go tuna fishing our last tuna trip of the year. It was scheduled for the Dolphin 2, and we had to move it. The Dolphin 2, um, not around anymore. So we had to move it, and we're gonna be on the Chief with Chris again, and that's gonna be in September. So we got two more tuna trips, two more chances to come out fish with us. Be lots of fun. Both those trips are 295, and, and it'll be great. Now, if you have some young kids, uh, 10 to 15, our Youth Foundation is having a free kids fishing club meeting this Saturday at Leg Lake in our clubhouse. And it's really a lot of fun. The kids come to the clubhouse, they learn uh, how to tie knots, meet other kids that are brand new to fishing, learning about fishing. And then after that, we go outside, do some casting. And then after that, we go walk the lake and go catch some fish. No monsters, lots of bluegill, some tiny little bass. But uh, to these little kids, catching a two ounce bluegill is like catching a blue marlin to me. They just have so much fun and I enjoy working with the kids and watching them catch their first fish. Probably about 40% of the kids or half the kids at these club meetings have never ever caught a fish before. So it's neat to watch these kids catch their very first fish. So that's the main things going on with the Youth Foundation. We have um, some ocean trips coming up. We have one on the 22nd um, out of San Pedro and one in uh, the 26th, also in August, that one's gonna be out of San Diego. So if you're a viewer of the show and you're in San Diego and you wanna help out, we could use your help with the Youth Foundation to take these kids fishing. We need about 10 volunteers per trip, take 35 kids out per trip. We do two trips a day. So we take anywhere uh, 35 to 45 kids. We take up to 90 kids a day. Everything's free for the kids. My Youth Foundation covers all that cost but we need volunteers to work with the kids and help them catch their very first fish. It's really rewarding work, and if you can join us, we could really use your help. Just uh, let you know, to be on the boat or any of our events that work with kids, in order to work with the kids, you have to go get live scanned, and it's all free. We cover all the costs for you. We'll set up the appointment. You just call our office here at 562-865-3764 and we'll send you to a location to go get live scan. Like I said, everything's free. All they're checking is to make sure that there's no um, convictions against crimes against kids. And if, you know, most of the time that's not a problem and everybody checks out clean and then you're more than welcome to come help us. Well, that's everything going on with the TV show, Youth Foundation. And thank you for watching our show. And if you notice that the new episodes that we're airing right now, a lot more kid friendly, a lot more how-to information and even some trivia in there too. Trying to change the show a little bit, make it more exciting, more fun for the younger viewers. And uh, all you older viewers are still watching, I know, because you want to see us pull those fish and cook those fish up. Well, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to watch us this weekend on your local station.